My aim is to build such a two-arm, wicked edge style knife sharpener out of Lego. With which I can make mirror polished, scary sharp cutting edges on my Swiss Army knives. Stay tuned if this sounds interesting for you. Hello YouTube! Welcome to another Swiss Army Knife project video. My kids like to play Lego. I guess they have over 15 or 20 kilograms Lego. But often they are desperate because a project doesn't work or a project fell apart because it wasn't stable enough. Or uh, they are looking for a specific tiny Lego part in such a pile of Lego. <laughs> but in green! <laughs> So I guess you know these problems if you have kids. Um, to be honest, actually I don't really like to play Lego with my kids. But recently I had an idea, as I saw, the joints of this flying monster. <laughs> Look at his joints. So this remembers me at the joints at the base of these two arm wicked edge sharpeners. And uh, since long time I wanted to try out to sharpen a knife with this move, <laughs> with a wicked edge sharpener. But these sharpeners are so expensive, um, so I thought why not try out to build such a sharpener uh, out of Lego. Let's do it.
like to tell you something about six points. Point number one, I'm not sure if I give back these Legos to my kids. <laughs> because this is one of my best knife sharpeners I have. Point number two, after the letter drops, I was not 100% happy with the result. That's why I made another abrasive holder and I added uh, a 4000 grit sandpaper on it. And after this, the result was perfect. Point number three. Yes, as you could see, this device has is not 100% stable and it has a little bit play. I'm sure you can build this much more stable, you can stabilize this one and look at this Lansky system for example. This has also a lot of play. Can you see that? Hmm? And even with such a Lansky, who has much more play than this machine, you can get a super result. So that's why I'm sure this works. Point number four. This joint, which is movable in all directions, is one of the core elements of this uh, knife sharpener. In my opinion, you have a lot of different options to make such a joint. One of these options is the, the option of this uh, flying dragon. Mm. So such a joint. It, this looks like this. Or I found something like this in small. This is also movable in all directions. It's stable enough. Then I found a card joint. This is prob probably the, the best solution. And the solution I used for my video is this one. And I'm sure you will find a lot more other options to make such a joint. Point number five. For the Ys, for clamping the knife body and for the Ys, which is clamping the blade, I used these M5 screws. Because these M5 screws you can turn in, in these holes, and they grip a little bit. Just a little bit, but enough that you can't pull them out. And uh, on the screw head, I put such a tire from a, a little wheel and now it's perfect to turn them in and out. I like this solution. Point number six is about the different angles you can set on this sharpening tool. I'll show you. So in this position I have 22 degrees on each side. This makes 44 degrees for the cutting angle. In this position I have 19 degrees on each side and this makes a 38 degree cutting angle. This is the smallest posi position you can choose. This makes uh, 15 degrees on each side. This made a 30 degree cutting edge. So my friends, that's it for today. I hope you like this LEGO project. Thanks a lot for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and see you next Friday. Ciao!